Now I skip into work. Teaching is so much fun. I am in a great school. Thomas Gillardi, a physical education teacher, has taught for the last nine years at PS 173 in New York and is affectionately known as Coach. Oh, we got a tie over here. Why did you want to become a phys ed teacher? I was always passionate in anything that I did. And I always gravitated towards sports. Soccer was really my game. Once I figured out I wasn't going to be a pro, I'm like, what else should I do? And I realized I kind of had a gift working with kids. Like, if I wanted to make them laugh, they'd laugh. If I wanted to make them do things, they'd listen. And I'm like, this is kind of fun. Coach is crushing it. The 2022 Elementary PE Teacher of the Year, who also happens to be a hit on social media. Hi, my name is Coach Gilardi. Creating the Phys Ed Zone in 2018 to help strengthen students, mostly through dance movement. After watching kid-friendly exercise videos online with his class, he thought, I can do that. I got a tripod and an iPad, and I did it. And I put it on my own YouTube channel. Welcome to the Phys Ed Zone. More than 22,000 YouTube subscribers and more than 5 million views later, Coach lunges and kicks, claps and jumps to encourage children's health and fitness. Are you ready? Two hands, same time. Where did the ideas come from for the movements and everything you're doing? I started asking the students, like, which songs do you want to hear? And I would just kind of say, let's do some free dancing to it. I'd watch them. And then I'd go to my basement and practice in front of the mirror. So these videos started before COVID? Yes, I had about 25 dance videos. And then COVID happened. Yeah. And everyone had to figure out remote learning. So now I went from teaching my school, my community, now I'm teaching everywhere. It was unbelievable. You got it? What do you see in him as a teacher? He really thinks about where phys ed's going to take kids. It's not just a job for him. He really what? is looking to inspire kids for their futures. Why is it important to get kids to play as part of exercise? We're living in a day and age where there's so many other options to avoid being fit. I see my students once a week, maybe twice at best. I know I'm making an impact, but what real impact can I really make in that short period of time mm -hmm. has been really my biggest challenge. On the flip side, Coach educates the next generation of PE teachers through TikTok. Tips for PE teachers. Where he has 74,000 followers and more than 3 million likes. Give it a try. Why did you want to do that? The best way for PE teachers to be prepared to teach is mentorship. So now they have their degree, they're applying for a position, and now they're teaching with really no skill. Why not share basic tips and tricks to help these future professionals? Time for me to get in the phys ed zone. One of the tips you have is a hula hoop hut. Yes. Can you help me make one? Of course. <laughs> Yeah. Yes, you're a good teacher. Finally, I get to join in imaginative fun and games with Coach and his students. No equipment needed, just a willingness to play along. First activity is called look away. There are lots of whistles. Freeze. Hopping and laughing. One foot, that's crazy. What? I can't do that. And the real crowd pleaser? Think rock, paper, scissors, plus a flexibility and balance challenge. Banana split. Oh no! Okay, I got this. Banana split. No! We had so much fun in PE class today. Yay! Give it a try! I just oh, had so what a much great fun. Teacher. And he taught me so many things that I did with my kids that weekend, which yeah. they just got such a kick out of. Um, Coach's wife is also a PE teacher. Oh, he got her nice. into that. Um, and while we were there, he also took time to talk to the kids about kindness and empathy mm -hmm. and just respecting oh, those that. around you. Um, he also, you saw that hula hoop hut, yeah. which you're like, what, what's the physical benefit of that? He showed me so many different ways to actually yeah. play with that, whether you it's crawl like into it, really whether you try to side. stack one on top of the other one um, you know so if you just if you look at his YouTube channel you'll get all these different ideas and it's a lot of fun stuff you can do at home with your kids I love that the and I think too. it makes Jim fun I told you as a kid I dreaded it I was laughing and just awesome. smiling the whole time he was the wonderful. best teachers meet the kids where they are exactly so good. And that is what he's clearly doing every day that was good how's it going thank you yeah 
Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.